Everybody. Mm, so day. without further ado, welcome. Mm. All day. Welcome, Making Pack Stereo. That's right. Making, not breaking. Welcome, everybody. We're back. Yes, we are back. So good to be back. Uh, for those of you who missed us, we it was a strange setup. Uh, viral illness hit us. Mm-hmm. Sort of the same time in different ways. Vic and me, we were knocked out. Last Saturday night, going into the night, we were cool. Mm-hmm. Well, not, not, not last Saturday before last, because it's yeah. Sunday. That's right. So That's you're right. still recovering. True. But a week ago, it hit us, and that was it for me, you guys. It hit me Saturday night around uh, 1130 midnight, and then I was shut down yeah. for some days. So, again, it's good to feel better and be back. It's funny when you get this stuff. You forget sometimes how bad these illnesses can make you feel. And maybe because of getting older, they may be hitting us harder, or at least hitting me harder. But, man, I was stunned to the degree in which it leveled me. <laughs> it, it came out of nowhere. Yeah, I was just the degree to which I was leveled. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Or the viruses yeah. are mutating. <laughs> maybe they're finding alternative ways like nanoviruses or something. It's going airborne. Yeah, it's going there, man. It's going airborne. <laughs> it's going airborne. Anyway, so you guys, again, thanks uh, to everybody who reached out to us. And uh, thank you, Kashanda, checking in. Everybody checking in on us because we are recovering from viral illness. But there's a bunch of stuff coming up. First of all, despite the fact that we were sick, some of the things did go on and planning did go on. Just yesterday, I am happy to announce that we were out at the residence of Amy Chala, mm-hmm. a good friend now, becoming a better friend all the time, who we met through Tim Siglin of Streaming Media Magazine. That's right. Okay, Streaming Media Magazine. What's happening in Streaming Media? That's right. Out there streaming. Tim Siglin, who writes everything. Brilliant man. I love him because, you know, it's like it's one of those things you meet. Sometimes you meet people. And you realize you're kind of like it some way. <laughs> yeah, it's true. You know, you kind of yeah, do. True. Hey, Tim, you and I, we kind of like it some ways. You know, it, it may seem like he's a, 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 a southern Caucasian guy who's a little younger than me. Right. Versus me, the dreadlock. But beyond the exteriors, there's a bunch of stuff in common. Uh, oh, yeah. It, just in terms of his interest and mine, he's such a, a, a geek. And remember, geek is not a negative term. Nerd is geek isn't. I'm a geek, and so uh, just saying, it's so good to, to, to kick in with Tim because we got had a chance to go out for Amy's showcase. She showcases her talent. Right. There'll be some pictures coming up. We're going to get some pictures, a few things, mm-hmm. uh, uh, and there's some video stuff coming up that Vic, that Vic shot. But she did her showcase, which they do uh, regularly, and we were pleased to be there. And so we'll be having some of that footage. So there we were yesterday. I think there's a picture. Or did I publish it? Yeah, I didn't publish it yet. Uh, Amrita, right? Her daughter, beautiful. Her right. picture will be it will be on the landing page. Yeah, Pack yeah. Stereo. You, you know, mo- just multicultural expansion. Right. It was good. You know, the thing about it is too. Also, if, if you do want to follow up and see some of the pictures, and now Miko did a great favor because she was with us as well. She posted a line of photos. I mean, really, for the most part. You can see under my profile, I'm, I'm, I, I'm assume Mari, she also maybe shared it with you, but on her profile, all the pictures, uh, unbelievable as it relates to what the theme was Who I uh, uh, when I was talking to Amy, who she came by this morning. Well, yeah, she did post them. i yeah, tell you she, what, and we she run said this Bollywood. bitch. Let's she, go take a look, right? Yeah, she said Bollywood. She says, this is a Bollywood entertainment gathering. All right, so, all right. You want to call it that? Well, let's go right take here. a look, you guys. I forgot, you know, the wonders of media. We can actually go do this. And Vic, because of what he's doing and what we and our setup here at Pack Stereo, yeah. uh, he can show you. Yeah. So I'm going to, without further ado, go to my page. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Wow. Uh, first of all, bec- even because of this already meeting people, right. Venudar Singh already has reached out and commenting about his music performance, and he wants me to view his uh, Facebook page. And these are folks we were meeting at the event. But come on, let's scroll on down. Miko's doing so much. Right. Uh, E.R. Ruiz. Oh, I, I like that brother. That's a good brother, E.R. Ruiz. I remember him. Take a look at the pictures. That Miko was now. I think if I go to one, I can just flow through them. Yeah. 
Take a look. Yeah. Take a look. Lovely. I sat out here in this area and ate and drank and partook of the wonderful vibes and energy. Nice spicy foods. There goes Amy. There's Amy right there. Mm -hmm. Amy Chala. They're performing wonderful setup. Look at the lovely decorations there at uh, her at her place. You know, we talk about artists performing out of the home. We how long have we been touting that? Twenty oh, years, forever. Yeah, I'm not trying to age myself. Okay, all right. right. Long <laughs> ass time. We've been told, telling people to perform out of their homes. Right. Have showcases out of their home, videotape. Right. And so Amy's one of those people. Who take it to. Here's lovely Miko. Right. Take a look. I saw lovely chocolate. Yeah, she has, she has some energy and uh, uh, almost inserted her comedy routine, so to speak, uh, along with the MC. Oh, with the show. They loved her. Let me tell you something. It is what it is. Those of you who know me know that I kind of am what I seem. <laughs> <laughs> Victor, too. Yep. And Miko is really as lovely and as down to earth and as friendly as she appears to be. So yes. she's a natural people magnet. You know, mm -hmm. I'm more the weird dude, like hiding back in the shadows against the wall. But, you know, Miko's out there. And so she's a people magnet and has that gift of making other people feel good. And therefore, she affected the folks at the event. You know, okay, first of all, they had laid all these candles and rose petals. Look right. at this. Right. Here's some of the folks from the, from the event. And I you just... I. I don't want to kill the names, but people Yeah, you like, know, we would blow these. We'd yeah. mess these. Oh, yeah. Can't do the best we can. Look at a lovely outdoor space. There's her daughter again. Look at, I'm telling you, I was munching. Munching and crunching. Yeah. Yeah, it was uh, food galore. That's an understatement. Wow. Yeah. Beautiful clothes. Beautiful people. Look at the rose petals. Yeah. There's her daughter again. Yeah, she's responsible and has her own designer along with her. So, you know. That's I think part of what we do, even on, as we're expanding our own, is we always act as ambassadors for internet television of the Indies. You know, and one thing about so many of our friends that we meet from India, so many of them are entrepreneurs. They're raised kind of like that, you know, to be entrepreneurs, to be businessmen. So even when they have one profession, Right. Reminds me some of my West Indian friends. Yeah. They That's still right. are entrepreneurs. Absolutely. And so, you know, her daughter's already an entrepreneur. Amy's an entrepreneur. So the whole thing of doing an indie record label, doing indie television, right up their alley. Right up their alley. Take a look. Such warm folks. It's amazing. There's one thing I will say that was amazing to me in my early years when I first met some folks from India. Being black. Though sometimes you reach out and touch their skin, and you look at them, and you, I remember one time me and a me and a, and a colleague, we were looking at each other and laughing, cause he was a little darker than me. <laughs> so, you, so you, what we're you were trying both, to find a connection? We, we would look at each, but you feel cause sometimes a connection, right? Even though there's the cultural difference, them being Asian again, right? But in looking at each other, the skin, it's just amazing sometimes when you look at them. I said, I told him, I said, you know, somehow, somehow I can't help but feel someone kind of bonded to you. We just laugh. Mm, wow. Because they do have that look sometimes. You meet some Indian folks and you wonder if they're black at first. True, true. You do, you wonder. It's a different color. Look, at you. look, here's the daughter. Isn't she lovely? Yes. Wow. Very much so. Look at our own Miko. So you guys, the excursions. Now who's that old man? <laughs> Hair getting long. Hey, so the whole excursions. Yeah. Part of Pack Stereo. Remember, we the thing. This is making Pack Stereo. So the thing that's going on right now is the, is to let you you know let you know about the ongoing show development. That's what's going on. So what we're doing is experimenting. We don't stress it. Right now, we're experimenting with the excursions. Things come up, and we go shoot them. And then we experiment within the ways to present them to you all to brand. So this is going to be one of the excursions, which yep. is when Victor and I kind of go out. Mm -hmm. to. It's like We left it as a general category. Right. It's us out. <laughs> true. So true. It's, and when we go out and do music and entertainment thing, it's the local zone. When it's, when it's non-entertainment, well, this could have been local zone. We, see, some of them could be either or. 
But we ended up making excursions because so much of it was the socialization right. with the folks. And it's really a lot of a, when we're really involved, it becomes the excursion. Typically, your local zone is featuring uh, entertainment acts mostly or events. That's, the cameras focus on supporting a lot of what they call em- entertainment uh, presentations of all types. So this was an excursion. It was a good. There's Vic, boy. Funny. Yeah, that really exciting picture right there. <laughs> hey, so that's one of the things. So, again... So the focus lately. So what's happening at Pack Stereo? We were sick. So not a whole lot new came, but I can tell you what, you know, as you're starting to recover from being sick, a lot of stuff was going through my head as I was starting to recover from being sick. So I can tell you that in terms of writing and creation, a lot of stuff coming, a lot of development of the series, drones, clones, and tones. Yeah. Uh, in terms of the upcoming, uh, one of our first uh, comedic series. Absolutely. Scripted series coming up. My my first time at writing and scripting, directing this kind of a thing. So thank God I have Vic with me. We, I'm just starting to lay out the stuff. Drones, clones, and tones. The series about the clones and the drones working behind the scenes here at Pack Stereo. So it's weird. Yeah. Weird stuff, but uh, uh, it's coming. So stuff coming on that, Vic. A bunch of stuff coming on the clones, drones. So we, we've got more scripting things coming. Yes. Part of this, especially the PMC, let me say the PMC, our brother from another mother out in Pittsburgh, who he laments, and you know, and I feel for him. He laments the fact that the, the morning coffee is not there the same in the morning. And I told him it's because we're using the other time for development, but he but he misses us. So I wanted him to understand these are the kind of things that we get to do now because yeah. we have the time because yeah. Mario has the free time now you can imagine we're doing all this work it's just Vic and I right. and the clones and the drone we'll get it but uh, because of that we couldn't get everything down now because of this we have more time for planning and more time for doing absolutely and special projects special projects nice. and uh, you know to add on to uh, we do have which you will find out more about this week. We are uh, scheduled in to have Michael Carl and Russell Poole in here as we follow up on the book and the story as it relates to their collaboration. Tupac. The, Tupac. the book, I believe, was Tupac, Tupac 187. 187. Tupac, one, Michael Carl and our wonderful buddy and his book. And he does wonderful investigative journalism. Yes. Uh, this whole thing he did about the border, issues at the border, with killings and things like that. Really controversial insider pieces. And he's got a new piece with some wonderful, wonderful, close, new information about the Tupac Shakur. This is kind of like part two. Part two. So we want you to come in and see. Take a look. There's something you can go see the previous interview. It's up there on YouTube. But also you can come there. We're playing that for this Saturday, right? Saturday at 7 p.m. is scheduled. Unless otherwise, we will let you know. But that's the slated time and the agreed upon arrangement with Pack Stereo. Bam. Wow, wow. <laughs> what about uh, this week? Coming this week, Monday night, we're going to have the return of the morning coffee uh, show, uh, special evening edition. Michelle Guerin's going to be there yes. on Monday night. So that should be yep. good. I've got some special things I'm going to share for you on Tuesday. You have the Quiet Storm. Don't forget the Quiet Storm pre-show with DJ Miko. Right. 7 p.m. Yep. Followed up with us at 8 p.m. The theme for this week. I just did it. Right. The theme The theme for this week on the Quiet Storm. Yeah, there we go. Okay. The theme for this week, and we want to thank Kashanda for sending in the theme. Uh, She had titled it Sexual Healing. We've done a recent sexual healing. But she said, why don't we do a show that's dedicated to the long, slow love songs? She said, what about the long, slow ones? Let me see how she said it. Mm. She said, okay, I got a theme for next week's show. It should be Sexual Healing, a tribute to provocative long songs. What do you think? I think it's a wonderful idea. We changed the title to We Love You Long Time. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> a cool. tribute to long and provocative love songs. Be there Tuesday night for The Quiet Storm. Remember, uh, DJ Miko at 7 p.m. Some of the featured artists, at least I'm thinking off the top, is going to be Isley Brothers, Music Love Child, excuse me, Love Child, Music Soul Child, yeah. 
Robert Glasper, Barry White. We're talking about long, provocative love song. So be there on Tuesday night. Bam. Okay. Yeah. All right. One last thing I want to show you is because of this whole issue of the drones and clones and tones, uh, as part of the show series, which is coming up, uh, Vic and I are planning to do some of our first. Besides, there's a bunch of firsts in this. Some of the first because it just is coming up that way. We have a bunch of scenes to shoot. Uh, looks like combat scenes. Mm-hmm. Between the drones and the clones, we have so since we've never done this kind of thing before, we're looking at a lot of the technology, and I and I wanted to to let you know that besides the extensive drone collection that we have now, and we're going to be showing you more and more of the drone collection. Victor's been taking pictures of it. Miko's been familiarizing herself with the drones and attempting to operate. Some of the nano drones, which are the very small ones. Well, as part of everything, and because I am interested also in our own security, I went on and invested in a series of combat drones that will be uh, essentially taking over security here at Pack Stereo. They'll be actually operating too within some of the movies and things. Yes, sir. And so I wanted you to take a look at. One of the combat drones that's coming up. Take a look at the attack net. Nice, man. Nice, nice. So I wanted everybody to be aware of the stuff that's coming up. Uh, we've actually enlo- en- we've enlisted some uh, some consultants, Vic, to sort of help with this, uh, hmm. to help us with the getting ready with the attack, uh, the combat drones. Okay. So we'll be training them for both combat security and also for the shows, for the movies. Sounds good to me. So, so it's going to be a little different. So we want to thank you for tuning in. Bam. Uh, tell you what, let's do this. You know, we like to leave. We like to leave with the latest uh, I Victor because, you know, the I Victor is the phenomena of the day. So we're going to leave you with the latest I Victor uh, showcasing our own hot chocolate once again. Nico. See you. Peace, everybody.
says when you speak.